In economics, a monopoly is a market with only one firm and no closed substitutes. This firm faces the entire market demand and can set the price. This is unlike firms in perfect competition, which are price takers. Because consumers have no alternatives, the monopolists can charge a price above marginal costs, creating market power. Profit is maximized where marginal revenue equals marginal cost, MR equals MC. Beyond this point, producing more reduces profit. The monopoly outcome leads to higher prices and lower quantities than perfect competition. This creates deadweight loss, unrealized gains from trade. We measure monopoly power using the Lerner index, which depends on the price elasticity of demand. The more inelastic the demand, the greater the firm's ability to raise prices. Monopolies exist due to barriers to entry, such as legal protection, like patents, resource control, or natural monopoly conditions, where it's more efficient for one firm to serve the entire market. Because monopoly outcomes reduce welfare, governments often regulate or intervene to minimize the inefficiencies. For example, companies managing utilities like water, where there is often no alternative supplier, but where demand is highly inelastic, or often tightly regulated or even owned by governments. This helps to ensure that the monopoly is not abused and fair access is guaranteed for all. Some key takeaways. Monopolis sets price where MR equals MC. Price is above marginal cost. It creates that way loss and lower consumer surplus. Follow economics for more core econ concepts.